Hey everybody, David here, and today I want to talk about my predictions for the upcoming Venom movie this weekend. Venom, of course, is hitting theaters, which is a spin-off to Spider-Man. Can you call it a spin-off if Spider-Man's not even connected? Uh, but the character is from Spider-Man's uh, rogue gallery of villains. Uh, this one now starring Tom Hardy, where in Spider-Man 3 he was played by Topher Grace. Obviously, Tom Hardy is going to knock this out. Will the movie be be any good? We'll have to wait and see this weekend, and I will be checking it out. Uh, and I do have two big predictions that I want to make before I go and see this film this weekend. Hopefully, it's going to be good. So, here is prediction number one. I think the prediction most people are asking themselves, is Spider-Man going to show up in this movie? Now, if you remember the late... Uh, great John Schnepp, who is the biggest sweaty of them all. He passed away a couple months back around Comic-Con. And uh, he had a source that told him that Tom Holland was spotted on set of the Venom movie. Uh, so he, his, the way he was talking was he was pretty sure that Tom Holland was going to appear as Peter Parker in this upcoming Venom movie. Now, how would that work in the timeline after what happened to Spider-Man in Avengers Infinity War? Maybe the movie takes place before the, the events of Infinity War. I don't know. But what do I think? Do I think that that source that John Schnapp had is, going to, is correct and we are going to see uh, Peter Parker make this appearance in this movie? I am going to answer no. I do not think we are going to see Tom Holland as Peter Parker or Spider-Man appear in this film at all. As much as I would love it for it to happen, um, it's something that I, I am not holding out hope for. Uh, because I, I don't even think Marvel trusts Sony that much yet with their own properties. Uh, on their own. The only reason we're getting Spider-Man Homecoming is because Marvel has more control over uh, the Spider-Man franchise right now. But when it comes to their solo Venoms or Morbius or Black and Silver or whatever movies they're coming up with, uh, I think uh, they're going to keep them separate for now. Uh, prediction number two, I have Will Carnage appear in the movie. This is another character that a lot of people aren't sure if he's going to show up. Uh, Woody Harrelson um, is in the movie and we we don't know what character he's playing and a lot of people are predicting that he might play Carnage. Now I don't know if he's going to be playing that character. Obviously they'll, if that's true maybe they're setting him up to appear as Carnage in the next film because Carnage is like the Joker or Lex Luthor. He is, he is the greatest villain to Venom in this case because Venom is Spider-Man's greatest villain. Uh, but considering he's an anti-hero, we're going to say Carnage is uh, Venom's greatest villain. So are you going to put Carnage in this movie? I, I think so. I don't know if he will be played by Woody Harrelson. Maybe he is. I don't. We haven't even seen him in the trailers yet, or at least I haven't noticed him in the trailers. Uh, but yes, I think we will see that being set up. Uh, maybe the symbiote. We'll see like a crimson symbiote on the floor because Carnage is usually like red and black, if I remember correctly, uh, while Venom is all black. So yeah, I, I think Carnage will be set up in this film. Uh, if not in the film itself, for sure in the post credit sequence, uh, which I guarantee, Mar Mar uh, not Marvel, Sony's going to put uh, something during the end credits to tease what's to come next, and I guarantee you it's going to be Carnage. Now, I have, I have another prediction while I'm doing this video. Will there be any setups to Silver and Black or... Morbius, because we know those are the, those are films that are being developed at Sony as well. And uh, I am going to say, I, I think we are going to get a little reference 
to Morbius. I don't think Silver and Black because from what I understood that was taken out recently. Um, they're like rewriting the script or something with that or rethinking the idea. But Morbius sounds like it's going to be a, a fair bet. That's that's going to happen next. So I wouldn't be surprised if we get a reference or hear something about vampires. Um, because Morbius is the living vampire. Um, so, yes, I think we will get a reference to Morbius in this movie as well. So, with that being said, guys, those are three predictions that I have for this upcoming Venom movie. Tell me what your thoughts are. Do you think we'll get any of these references? Uh, Spider-Man, Carnage, or any of the other upcoming uh, Sony Marvel movies that Sony is cooking up? Comment below. I hope you guys like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. And until next time, take care.